Yes, when I was in school, I distinctly remember a picture in a government textbook of four children standing around a picture of Sri Lanka. So one would be in the Osiria, and then I'd see, oh, that little girl's in a dress, that's me. But as time went on, I see them represented less and less, and it's more of an afterthought. Most people aren't aware of them. Sometimes being a burger is synonymous with being a Christian. And those who do know the difference, it's burgers are perceived as the easygoing, fun types, great for a good time. They throw a good party, but they're never really taken seriously. So I feel like that makes the burgers themselves very disenchanted with the nation as a whole. Um, my great grandfather. He used to work at the Sri Lankan Irrigation Department under when we were British colony. And with the pass of the Sinhala Only Act, he was demoted with several others who weren't Sinhali speakers. So he was shifted from Ratmalana to Kinya to Trinko and back and forth. But he had to do it, even though he didn't speak a word of Sinhalese. And it wasn't the easiest language for him to learn, especially in a household where you don't really speak that language. And everyone is in Australia. For the longest time, I had the backup plan to move to Australia because I felt like I didn't belong. Again, because I'm fair-skinned, people automatically assume I don't speak Sinhalese. Oh, really? You're Sri Lankan? Are you sure? Do you speak Sinhalese? Or can you speak Sinhalese to me? So it makes you sad and you just feel like you don't belong even though you think of them as your people. I still don't feel like part of the country even though Sri Lanka is the country it is because of its differences, because of its cultural backgrounds, not in spite of it and always being questioned about who you are if you are a true Sri Lankan. It's saddening because I don't know when only being able to conform and speak loud language became synonymous with loving your country and being a patriot. And that shouldn't be how it is. I love this country and I want to feel like I'm an actual citizen.